Hey VR friends, in today's quick video, I'll show you how the Reality Mixer app has become even cooler and now allows you to record mixed reality videos on your iPhone in really high quality, especially for a mobile app with a green screen. If you don't know, Reality Mixer is an iOS app developed by Fabio Dell'Antonio that allows you to record mixed reality videos using Oculus Quest 2 without a PC and using only your iPhone. That function was really cool because not everyone has a green screen in their homes, but the quality was noticeably lower than more powerful mixed reality tools, which take advantage of the green screen. Luckily for us, now Reality Mixer supports the green screen function, and in this video I'll show you how to use it. Reality Mixer is super easy to set up. All you will need is your iPhone XR or newer with at least an A12 chip because that's the one that started supporting person segmentation. Unfortunately, Android phones do not support it. However, the green screen mode also works with older iPhones that can run iOS 14, such as iPhone 7, so that's great news. You can check my earlier videos showing how to use Reality Mixer to record mixed reality videos without a green screen and even create augmented reality effect. I also explain in great detail detail how to set up the app, but in this video, I will go through this process briefly. First, go to the App Store and install an app called Reality Mixer. After that, on your quest, download and install Mixed Reality Capture. If you can't find it by searching, I included the link to it in the video description. Calibration will be an important step in the setting up process, so make sure that you have a tripod or something to secure your phone, because you should not be moving your camera during the calibration. There are some really inexpensive tripods on Amazon, so I'm sure that you'll be able to find something cheap there. Set up your phone where you want it, open Reality Mixer and tap on Start Calibration. After that, put on your Quest and open Mixed Reality Capture. You will see this IP address. Type it in exactly the way you see it in the Reality Mixer app. During this step, make sure that your Quest is awake. I usually just keep it on my forehead. Hit Connect and the app will open your camera, which will help you set up the right angle. The first step in the calibration, bring your right controller close to the camera and hit the A button. Then take a few steps back, hold the controller in front of you and hit the A button again. At this point, the Reality Mixer will snap a picture of you and you'll be able to come closer to your phone. You will see this blue dot which will need to be aligned with your right controller. You can zoom it in to align it better and when you're ready, tap on Next and then Save to Headset and your calibration will be saved. After that, click on Start Mixed Reality. This is where things will get a little bit different. By default, the app will be set to Virtual Green Screen, which will automatically separate you from the background, but if you have an actual green screen in the room, you need to tap on green screen slash chroma key to activate the physical green screen mode. It is very important to actually configure your chroma key before starting your mixed reality. Tap on configure chroma key and pick the color that you want to remove. This green looks very close to the color of my green screen, but you can also click on this color picker that allows you to pick the color directly from the video. You can see that it already removed most of my green screen, but you can play around with the sensitivity so that the app does a better job. After you removed all of the green screen, it's time to set up your mask. In other words, crop everything else that you don't need. Tap on Add Mask and there you'll be able to clean up your screen so that everything on the screen looks transparent except for you. It might take you a few tries, don't get discouraged, and make sure that you have good lighting on your green screen so that it's all the same color. When you're ready, tap on Save. Before you connect, first you will need to run a mixed reality compatible app. Make sure to check this website that I listed in the description to see the list of all games that support mixed reality recording. This list is constantly updating, so remember to check it from time to time as new games get released. Today I'm going to play Synth Riders, the new Caravan Palace DLC. As soon as the game starts, come to your phone and tap on connect. You can recenter the view if you'd like, but overall, that's all you need. Now the quality of your mixed reality recording will be on the same level with this simple trick if you have a green screen at home and you don't even need a computer or a professional camera, just use your iPhone's native screen recorder. This is a game changer because recording mixed reality with this method is easy, it's fast and the quality is very impressive if you edit out the green screen properly. Now you know how to easily improve your mixed reality videos, but this is not the only thing that the reality mixer can do. You can also use it to record mixed reality with moving camera. The only problem is that you won't be able to crop out the areas that don't have the green screen, so this mode will be best if you have a very 
a large green screen surface, like the whole corner or the whole room. Reality Mixer can also be used to record with the augmented reality effect. Check out how to do it in this video tutorial. Augmented reality also supports the moving camera, and it looks quite impressive too. Let me know in the comments if you would like me to create a tutorial on how to use moving camera and the augmented reality effects. I hope you've enjoyed this video, and if you found value in it, please remember to give this video a like and subscribe to DiscoVR for more informative and fun VR content. Thank you so much for watching, stay safe, and as always, happy gaming!